if, you, if I may, I'm going to ask you um, something about another subject, because in the report you talk about ending discrimination, but you've also been accused yourself of discrimination against LGBT people, and I think there was a, a demonstration outside yesterday where you went to talk to people. Now, it's 10 years ago today that same-sex marriage bill was passed in the House of Commons, and here we are with the church refusing to back gay marriage. You've personally refused to bless same-sex marriage. Is there an issue of credibility here that on the one hand you're asking for inclusion and better care for the elderly and people in our communities in society, whilst on the other hand you're discriminating against the LGBT community? That's what people might think. That's what people might think. I accept that's what they, people might think and that's... Uh, they weren't talking about care last night, but the people outside demonstrating, I went out there, and there's mm. Ben Bradshaw, MP, mm. and Jay Nozan leading, and Peter Tatchell. And um, they were saying that we got it wrong as a church. There are two things there. First, we have made a huge step, which is to say that if someone is married in a civil marriage, equal marriage to someone of their own gender, um, same-sex marriage, that they can come to church and be have that married marriage recognised and uh, thanked for and um, uh, dedicate themselves to God and seek God's blessing in their lives. Mm. And that's something that we've never done before. And it's controversial. Um, I'm getting equal amount of flack from the other side about having compromised traditional Christian standards. Mm. The second thing is the Archbishop of York, who's going to use these resources that we've published, and I, uh, and I'm not, are on exactly the same page. We welcome these resources strongly, but we have slightly different jobs. I'm also the senior bishop in one sense or another, the first mm. among equals, around the whole world, where in many countries, there are very, very different attitudes. And my job is the pastoral care and to care for and support people in 165 countries with every sort of culture and language. If you were not the first among equals, would you personally bless same-sex marriages if you were not... I support the, the use of these resources. So I, uh, it's, they, they bless so, the people in same-sex marriages. So is it marriages. hard for you not to be able to do what you personally would like to do then? No, I accept that it's part of my role. It's just the way it is. But you accept that there's a conflict there that's uncomfortable? Yeah, it's not comfortable, but, you know, the church is deeply divided over this issue. Every global church is. And the church in this country is in every denomination. We have to face the reality. It's no use wishing the world was other than it is. And just finally, uh, this weekend, we had news of the coronation. Oh.